Hello friends, I am Sanjay Gupta. In this video, I am going to discuss about a program which is written in C++. Before that, I want to share my details with you. Uh, you can note down my contact number and email ID so that you can uh, discuss any query with me. You can uh, visit my website. You can download my app TagMS. It is very useful app. Here, uh, tutorials about C, C++, PHP, Java, Ethical Hacking are available. You can download PPTs of various programming languages by following this link. You can read various books which are authored by me. Uh, you can subscribe and watch my YouTube channel. Uh, here, uh, videos related to various programming languages are available. So these information will be very helpful for your study and placement purposes. Now coming on to the program. The program is uh, to calculate area and perimeter of rectangle. So uh, this program is implemented with the help of uh, the method uh, through which we can define member functions outside the class. So uh, the first statement is header file includes IO stream. Then I have included uh, or used a namespace which is std. It is also uh, predefined. Then object of uh, this uh, program is rectangle. That's why name of class is rectangle. Then uh, two variables uh, of float types are declared L and B. These are data members and these are pri uh, private by default uh, because I have not uh, used private but still these variables are private. Then in public section I have defined uh, four uh, functions uh, sorry declared uh, four functions read print area and parameter. So uh, inside class I have only declared these functions but outside the class you will uh, find out definitions of these functions because I am using uh, the second method of defining member function which is defining member functions outside the class. In other uh, videos of mine you uh, can find out the functions which are defined inside the class. So this is first function which is defined outside the class. So you have to notice on this function first return type is available then rectangle is name of the class then scope resolution operator then name of function and then parenthesis. Then in C out I have mentioned a message enter length, enter values of length and breadth. Then L and B will read these values which will be entered by the user. Then uh, second function which is rectangle uh, scope resolution print uh, it is defined. So you can see that all uh, the outside member functions are defined with the help of scope resolution operator. So inside this function I have printed length and breadth values on console. Andal is used uh, for uh, separating line on console. Then third function is area. So this is also defined with the help of scope resolution operator. Here a variable is declared which is calculating uh, area of rectangle uh, by the formula L into B. Then with the help of C out area is printed on console. Then fourth function is parameter calculation. So this is also implemented with the help of scope resolution operator. Here p variable is declared which is of float type then with the help of formula I have calculated parameter uh, formula is 2 into l plus b then with the help of c out uh, the parameter of uh, this calculation will be printed on console here p variable is used which will display its value. After definition of these four functions main function is defined inside main first statement is variable or object creation name of object is r. Then with the help of r.read length and breadth will be read. Then to check whether the information uh, have been read properly or not r.print is used. Then r.area will print the uh, area of this rectangle. Then r.parameter will print the calculated parameter on console. So friends you can implement uh, the program with the help of defining member functions outside the class as well as you can implement this program by defining member functions inside the class which is inline member function method. So after this explanation now I am compiling this code. So you can see that number of errors and warnings are zero. So now I am executing this code. So it is asking for length and breadth. So I am entering three and four. So you can see that length is three breadth is four area is 12 and parameter is 14. So you can uh, say that program is working properly all the results are correct. So we can implement uh, the uh, functions uh, in, uh, uh, in a particular class 
uh, outside uh, the class definition uh, with the help of scope resolution operator so implement this program in your laptop so that you can understand the concept behind it thank you for watching this video